It's too hot, Sheila. Who's this? This is my pal, Isa. Hello, Isa. Isa lives in Craig Lang. Craig Lang? I, oh, I used to love Craig Lang. Of course, it's changed a lot now, hasn't it? <laughs> what was the name of that pub? Oh, I used to go in there often. Uh, the, the Clacken, was that it? No, 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 no the Clacken. Was, was it like the Clacken? <laughs> Clansman. <laughs> Well, I'll, I'll tell you what I'm doing. I'm going to go along to the pavilion, sit and have a nice cold drink. That sounds nice, Isa. Hey, <laughs> want to take a walk down, Sheila? Um, I. That would be lovely. Is that all right, Isa? <laughs> Jesus, um, is your pal no right? <laughs> Time is it? Yeah, 25 to 8. This is strange. No. Well, if this is the gate that Tam and Winston have been using, where are they? Yeah, right enough. Oh, well, maybe they're not coming today. What else would they be doing? Is that other gate opened yet? No, nope, not yet. So this is the first gate you've opened? Aye, how? No reason. Out of way. Oh, well. The accuses are not being organised. <laughs> Big flask of tea, sandwiches, radio. Uh -uh. And a couple of macaroon bars for three o'clock. <laughs> Aye, you're well sorted. All you're needing now is the number one bench. <laughs> <laughs> you one-legged fat bastard. How in God's name did you... Too late! <laughs> uh, don't start with a stick. For as old as you are, I'll take it after you and jam it up your arse. <laughs> this is all right, eh? Aye, well, aye, aye. This'll do, is I? Could be done with a wee bit more shade, but... Aye, well, we're here to soak up the rays. Number one bench. A lot of garbage. Aye, it's a lot of garbage. A bench is a bench is a bench. You said it, boy. I need to sit down. It'll not be long now. I've been standing for 20 minutes. I don't feel well now. It's just because you're thirsty, Charlie. We'll get you a drink in a wee minute. No. I need to sit down. I can feel the sweat running down the crack of my ass. <laughs> Wait a minute, Charlie. Let the queue's moving. Shut up. I'm sitting down. Right, you two. Budge. Uh, now, wait a minute here. There's really only room for... Uh, right, <laughs> sit down. Another cracking day, boys. It was indeed, Eric. Where were you? Oh, I had a good gin. Put the tranny on, filled the bath up with cold water, laid my back all day. Magic. Oh, that sounds nice. You've got to keep cool in weather like this. That's the beauty of that spot we've got. Best of both worlds. Mr. Sun comes up over there and then sets way over there. Go to all day. Ah, but you're under a tree, you see. And that lets in just enough sunlight. And see when you think you're getting just that wee bit too hot? Lovely breeze comes along and cools you right down. Honestly, Eric, it's nature's wee miracle. That's the only seat that gets it to. Everybody else is, well, burning, aren't they? Am I right, boys? <laughs> Are you not dancing, eyes off? No, no, I'll let you go. All right, then. <laughs> oh, and you've been picking that up in your radar? Certainly am. Right, well, I've walked all the way round the park, apart from the front gate and the Galloway gate. This is it. There's not even a hole in the fence. Well, this must be it, then. Yeah. Oh. Can I help you? 
Hey, just come in, son. No in here, you're no. Employees only. This is the service gate. How in the bloody hell are they getting in? They must have a tunnel. <laughs> Thanks again, Craig. Yes? Money back. What the hell is it now? You're haunting me, woman. I did what you asked. I put all the chocolates in the fridge, just like you said. you get on with the dancing? Did you meet the man of your dreams? No. I'm just no cut out for it, Naveed. Sheila and Elsa didn't seem to have a problem, though. Is that who you went with? Aye. Aye, well, this is your problem. I have no way. It's all about perception. They are bubbly, gregarious, attractive women. You are like a novice. You have to stack the odds in your favour. How do you mean? It's who's with you that's the problem. You need to get an ugly pal. A hound. <laughs> then next to her, you look like Kevin and Diaz. Oh, no. What a horrible way to go about things. To do that to another person? That's just like using somebody. Oh, no. No, no. Thanks, son. <laughs> I live and breathe, John McLaughlin. The very same. How are you, Edith, darling? I can't remember the last time I saw you. Well, I can. And neither of us had any draws on. <laughs> Thanks, Isa. Oh, I am magic. <laughs> oh, wait. This is magic, isn't it? Aye. I love sticking it to these two old bastards. <laughs> Think they've geared up yet? Oh, aye. There's your pal, sir. <laughs> Jesus, that's him. Hurry up, get a spot on. <laughs> what now? Jump here. Who do you think I am? Bloody Steve Austin! Hey! <laughs> what really thought this through up with Jack? Just go further up the lower you down. Well, here's a good idea. You come up the ladder and I'll come down. Will you go further up to the lower you down? <laughs> hey, Jack. Easy now. Easy now. That's you. That's you, that. Hey, hey. There you go. That's you. Easy, easy. Oh. 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 Hurry up, you silly bastard. I'm running out of time. Hurry, get off my back. <laughs> oh, Victor, go and get a seat. Go and get a seat. Oh, 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 yeah. oh, oh. Victor. Face it, Isa. You're never going to meet Emd. You don't need to meet Emd. I enjoy my own company. Trying to meet a fail at my age. It's undignified. <laughs> Any time you get a seat in this bloody park when they're shutting it. 
Get a wee read at my paper and get up the road for my dinner. Are you local? Just over there in the flats. Oh, aye. Uh, the flats are nice. I'm Isa. Hello. I love the park. So beautiful. You appreciate a thing like a park at your age, don't you? I'm gonna take a walk in the Pavilion Palace. You had to come with me. I'd be smashing. Just let me finish up here. This will do us. This is where we belong. Okay, okay. Can I offer you some breakfast, sir? Avec pleasure. Yeah. yeah. Is that clouds? <laughs> eh? <laughs> you want to leave? What? On you? Nelly. <laughs> <laughs> the comedy continues over on BBC One tonight. Victor Meldrew's treading the boards. Boozy birds are getting into fights on BBC Three. And from BBC Four, why did Adam Adamant inspire such a devoted following? And after news nights here on BBC Two, catch up with Rome. Died. I thought, what's holding me back? Why couldn't I meet somebody else, you know? Why shouldn't I meet somebody else? Quite right. What age are you? Oh, he he <laughs> you. <laughs> well, I don't mind telling you. I'm no spring chicken. I'm not long off retiring. Aye, but I see you're wearing a wedding ring. Uh, yeah. All the good bands are taken. I'm sure you'll meet somebody nice. <sighs> Anyhow, shall we? Aye. Which one do you think it is? Number four, Daddy Pig. <laughs>